a steep gravel pass lies between Newcastle in KZN and Mirmel in the Free State. The pass traverses a natural path up the Drakensberg and is located roughly 33 kilometers west-southwest of Newcastle and 15 kilometers northeast of the Norman Dean Pass. It's okay to drive this in a normal car, subject to conditions being dry. Like most buses in this part of the Drakensberg, it is subject to heavy electrical storms in summer, as well as snowfalls during winter. In such conditions, a 4x4 vehicle is a much safer option. This part of the Drakensberg is rich in waterfalls. This pass boasts two of them, the Inkandu Falls near the turnoff from the main Newcastle Road, as well as the Twispreit Falls beyond the summit. Catch them after good rains and you'll be in for a visual treat. The pass starts at an altitude of 1,470 meters, about 33 kilometers west-southwest of Newcastle and is well signposted. It rises steadily through 365 vertical meters to summit at 1,835 meters, providing beautiful views out over the Cathedral Peak area as well as the Lost Valley. Gradients can get quite steep and they average out at 1 in 16 with the steepest sections being at 1 in 7. The pass is well designed by gravel road standards and sports 11 corners, 9 of which are fairly easy but there are 2 that need special attention and need to be treated with respect. The first is a 150 degree right hand hairpin at the 4.2 km mark and the second is the left hand exit bend out of this ravine at the 4.6 km point which has a turn radius of 100 degrees. The Ukoschlamba Drakensberg Park is one of KwaZulu-Natal's two World Heritage Sites. This World Heritage Site is part of a much longer mountain range that stretches some 1,600 kilometers from South Africa's northernmost provinces to the Eastern Cape. Not only does the World Heritage Site protect a stunning natural mountain wilderness area, it also protects an amazing cultural legacy of ancient rock art in Africa, painted by Southern Africa's earliest inhabitants, the San or the Bushmen. The Ukashlamba Drakensberg World Heritage Site is also part of a larger collaborative conservation initiative between South Africa and the neighboring kingdom of Lesotho called the Maloti Drakensberg Transfrontier Conservation and Development Project. The Zulu people named the 300 km section of mountain range bordering KwaZulu Natal and the mountain kingdom of Lesotho Ukashlamba, which means Barrier of Spears. The early Dutch settlers called them the Drakensberger or Dragon Mountains. Nowadays, this lovely natural wonderland is referred to by locals simply as the Berg. One of the world's most famous choir schools, the Drakensberg Boys Choir School, is based in the central Berg area and it's a delight to attend one of their regular concerts. The pass ends at the 5.7 km point at a fork in the road at an altitude of 1,810 meters. Make sure you see the nearby Nkandu Falls near the intersection of this road and the main road through to Newcastle. <music>